Darren Ambrose has backed Wilfred Zaha to leave Crystal Palace in the summer, as he highlighted how he could have left in the past for Arsenal and Everton. The Palace forward is out of contract in the summer and there has been talk of Liverpool and Mikel Arteta's Arsenal wanting to take him on for nothing, as reported by 90 Minutes. During the early years of Zaha's career, he did join Manchester United, but six months after signing on the dotted line, Sir Alex Ferguson left. It didn't help his cause because he joined a ship that was about to sink, with David Moyes at the time, and many managers since, all struggling. Since then, he has continued to shine and showcase his worth, including scoring 6 from 16 this season, 14 last term and 11 during the previous campaign. But first, if you're new to the Arsenal News Channel, take advantage and subscribe so you don't miss the latest news that happens in the football world. We're always bringing you firsthand here, enjoy and like this video, so that YouTube continues to bring you the latest news from Arsenal in the world of football. And that for a team sitting mid-table, so is it time for the next step up? Ambrose wants to see what he can do for a Champions League team, as he told Stadium Astro. If he signs a new contract at Crystal Palace, then he will end his career at Crystal Palace, said Ambrose. I would yeah, to see Zaha sign a new deal, as someone associated with Palace, then I would love to. If I put my neutral head on, then I would love to see how far Wilf can get in the game. I believe he can play for anyone and not make them worse. It almost happened a while ago with Arsenal and Everton came in. I look and think he could maybe go abroad. Maybe a Dortmund, they, Palace, have enough to let Wilfred Zaha leave. We haven't said that for a long, long time. WHO would take Zaha? Everton might have wanted Zaha in the past, but given their recent struggles, then that is now out of the window. But should Arsenal be ruled out? The 30-year-old would elevate their squad, but given that they signed Leandro Trossard in January and also have Gabriel Martinelli on that left side, then you can probably rule that one out too. Liverpool need midfielders, not attackers, whilst Zaha would, funnily enough, suit Manchester United now under Eric Ten Hag, but would they be keen to knock on his door again? Either way, given how Zaha has been performing of late, he deserves that step to a team in Europe. 